In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use the art from hand-drawn whiteboard mega bundle and the pro and the monthly level even uh, with um, Easy Sketch Pro. And you'll note that I'm using version 1.08, uh, so it might look a little different if you haven't upgraded to this version or after this video if they've upgraded since then. So this is just crazy easy. And so what, we, what you really want to do is you want to work with an SVG file, and that's why there's a lot of uh, SVG files included with um, hand-drawn whiteboard mega bundle. And so I've put one of them on the stage here on my local hard drive, and you want to navigate to where it, wherever it is. If you're on a Mac, you're going to need to uh, click uh, to maybe kind of search for your desktop if that's what you're using. But in any case, well, you just click here on this icon. I'm going to do load images from PC. By the way, you can make your own library now. That's what... Uh, major feature uh, that they added in 1.08 so you could basically import the images and make your own library with the hand-drawn art as part of, this, as part of the uh, content. But go ahead and click on load images from PC and then there's uh, this little folder icon right here. You click on that and you can see that I've put that on my desktop. I've got just this uh, image right here and you simply open it and hit done and there it is and then hit just click and draws this thing. It's just wicked awesome and simple. Now just a few little tips here. Um, now you can move it around and everything. Now you, you'd commonly probably think that if you click on it and then hit delete it would you know go away but it doesn't work that way. You need, now there's a couple things you can do. I think there's like a right click or something like that but you know you can also just double click on it and then just to delete up here and that will get rid of it. You can delete it that way. Now there isn't an undo on this, but it's so crazy easy to go ahead and just import your image again, uh, that kind of thing. So, uh, you know, I would, I really wouldn't sweat that. They'll probably add that as a feature in the future. In the pro level, we're going to talk about how you can create your own SVG files using Flash and Illustrator, and we're also going to look at some more advanced techniques for combining up images and really being able to take this to the next level. Uh, but Easy Sketch Pro is really this easy, so um, really have fun with this.